Hello there, welcome to unit number six. The title of this unit is How often do you exercise? How often? So, cuan a menudo? How often do you exercise? So, number one is snap shop. Uh, the top five sports and fitness activities in the United States. So, talking about sport, basketball, volleyball, softball, football, and soccer. Yeah. Fitness activities we have weight training, treadmill, stretching, uh, walking, and jogging. Treadmill is una, es una caminadora. Stretching, ya saben que eso es antes de empezar cualquier partido, hacen un poco de stretching. Ok. And jogging es trotar. Okay, jogging is total. Okay, so uh, work power, sports, and exercise. So you have to complete the char. Which of these activities are popular with the following age groups? Check the activities, then compare with a partner. You have to do this. For example, aerobics. Aerobic. Uh, children, teens, young adults, middle-aged people or older people. I think uh, aerobics is for teens and young, young adults and middle-aged people. What do you think? I don't know. can be different. So, so here is very important because you have to put uh, the this word with do, go, or play. So you have to know when you gonna use go and when play or do with these words. For example, do aerobics, do yoga, okay? Go bicycling, uh, go swimming, or go weight training, or go swimming, right? And play, well, play baseball, play tennis, and play whatever, you know, play soccer for example, play soccer. So, you have to complete this, it's very important. Okay, so now let's listen to this conversation uh, about Mary and Paul. I hardly ever exercise, so let's listen the conversation. B7. Exercise 3. Conversation. I hardly ever exercise. Casi Part nunca. A. Hago ejercicio. Listen and practice. Okay, listen and You're practice. You're really fit, Paul. Do you exercise a lot? Well, I almost always get up early, and I lift weights for an hour. Seriously? Sure. And then I often go inline skating. Wow. How often do you exercise like that? About five times a week. What about you? Oh, I hardly ever exercise. I usually just watch TV in my free time. I guess I'm a real couch potato. Oh my goodness. Okay, so... Uh, you're really fit. O sea, está realmente en forma. Tú está bien, ¿ok? Do you exercise a lot? ¿Te ejercitas mucho? Entonces él responde... I almost always get up early casi siempre me levanto temprano and I live wait for an hour él hace pesa por una hora seriously? en serio? sure and then I often go in live skating I often a menudo ¿verdad? a menudo pues aquí lo, lo estos patines okay how often do you exercise like that about five times a week cinco veces por semana what about you that means and you i hardly ever exercise casi nunca almost always casi siempre y hardly ever casi nunca me ejercito I usually just watch TV in my free time. I guess I'm a real couch potato. Couch potato, couch potato. Uh, it's a very lazy uh, person. 
that is a couch potato okay so now let's see grammar focus adverse of frequency vamos a ver los adverbios uh, de frecuencia aquí tenemos una tablita un porcentaje cuando es 100% se dice always I always I always almost always casi siempre usually usualmente often a menudo sometimes algunas veces hardly ever casi nunca almost never casi nunca también pero ya esta es como rara vez y esto es como casi nunca ok y never es 0% never nunca never ok vamos a escuchar ahora let's listen the adverse of frequency page 37 Exercise 4. Grammar Focus. Adverbs of Frequency. How often do you exercise? I lift weights every day. I go jogging once a week. I play soccer twice a month. I swim about three times a year. I don't exercise very often. I don't exercise very much. Do you ever watch TV in the evening? Yes, I often watch TV after dinner. I sometimes watch TV before bed. Sometimes I watch TV before bed. I hardly ever watch TV. No, I never watch TV. Okay, very good. Always. Always here, always. Let's continue. Almost always. Almost always. Usually. Usually. Often. Often you have to repeat it. Sometimes. Sometimes. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Almost never. Almost never. Never. And never. So how often do you exercise? Cuán a menudo hace te ejercitas? Entonces aquí vemos I lift weights every day, todos los días, once a week, una vez a la semana, twice a month, three times a year, tres veces al año. Uh -huh. Vemos aquí que sometimes lo podemos usar tanto al principio como después del sujeto. For example, I sometimes sometimes watch TV before bed. Or you can say sometimes I watch TV before bed. So you can use sometimes at the beginning or in the middle. Okay. All right. Very good. Okay, so put the adverse in the correct place, then practice with a partner, okay? So, for example, do you play sports? Sure, I play soccer. So, do you ever play sports? Sure, I play soccer twice a week. Okay, number two, what do you do on Saturday mornings? What do you usually do on Saturday mornings? Nothing much. I almost always sleep until noon. I almost always sleep until noon. So you have to finish this exercise. Okay, all right. Now let's listen the this conversation. I'm a real fitness freak. So I have some fanatico. De estar ejercitado y esas cosas. Exercise 5. Pronunciation. Page 38. Exercise 7. Listening. Okay. Page 39. Exercise 10. Conversation. I'm a real fitness freak. Part A. Listen and practice. You're in great shape, Keith. Thanks. I guess I'm a real fitness freak. How often do you work out? Well, I do aerobics twice a week. And I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot of fun. Oh. Do you want to play sometime? Uh, how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Well, all right. But I'm not very good. No problem. I'll give you a few tips. Okay, very good. You're in great shape, Keith. Está en forma, shape, forma. I'm a real fitness freak. Soy un, un fanático de, de, de estar siempre ejercitado y esas cosas. Okay. 
That sounds like a lot of fun. Eso suena divertido, me parece. Eso está va, va, está bien, okay? How well do you play? Cuán bien o qué bien juegas? How well do you play? Pretty well, muy bien. Pretty well, muy bien. Okay? I'll give you a few tips. I'll, I will, I'll give you a few tips. Te daré algunos consejos, algunos secretitos, algunos truquitos. Okay, so now grammar focus. Question with how. Short answer, for example. How often do you work out? Every day, twice a week. Not very often. How often? Está hablando aquí de la frecuencia. Entonces tiene que usar every day, twice a week. No very often. Okay, how long do you spend at the gym? Eh, todo está hablando de tiempo. How long? Tiempo. Entonces las respuestas son 30 minutes a day, 2 hours a week, about an hour on weekends. So, how well do you play tennis? Aquí está hablando de qué bien, qué tan bien. Entonces las respuestas son pretty well, muy bien. About average, o sea, ahí entre dos. No very well, no muy bien. How good are you at sports? Estas preguntas son casi similares. How good? How well? So you can answer pretty good, okay, or not so good. So uh, this is the unit number six and that's set for today. See you next time.